I'm CM Coleman, welcome to my home. Today we are making the biscuit mix that I meant to make last week, but I absolutely forgot I hadn't made it. Isn't that sort of funny? It's one of those things where you get caught up in things and the holidays and everything that was coming out. And we are going to do this really easy, it's really quick, it's really simple. You will love it. And you can use this biscuit mix for many things, just like the champagne biscuits that I made there. And there are other great recipes that are going to be coming up with the uh, biscuit mix. Here is how you do it. And you can double this recipe, triple this recipe. The one thing to remember is keep it in the refrigerator because it does use shortening. Uh, you could say, well, why aren't you using butter? I did find the butter didn't work that well in this recipe. It's really weird and I won't say why, but uh, because I can't say why, but it did not work well. So shortening is what it had to be. So let's start it off. I have two cups of uh, flour and then half a teaspoon of baking soda two teaspoons uh, yeah two teaspoons of baking powder i'm sorry three teaspoons of baking powder check the description below it has the real recipe this is two tablespoons of raw sugar and to that i'm going to add a pinch of sea salt the final ingredient we will add is just two tablespoons of shortening i'm going to whisk that together and i'm not using my normal beater because we need to whisk this together until it resembles fine crumbs it'll take a while so let's let this thing go once we have the fine crumb texture i am just going to using a funnel because we all know how messy i can be i will just take this pour it into my container seal it up and there I have biscuit mix how easy was that and you can use this everywhere but remember keep it in the refrigerator and this works just like any other biscuit mix that you would have we're gonna have a recipe next week which will show you how to make a special kind of biscuit but you can use this biscuit mix wherever and this is just another one of those things where you can make it yourself instead of buying it because you can save some money doing that remember to subscribe every monday through friday at something different tuesday is always a recipe don't forget to check out my latest videos and you can if you make this let me know you can reach me on most social media at cm coleman home i love hearing from you and i love your ideas and suggestions if you have anything which you'd like to see me make let me know down in the comments and remember, running your house doesn't have to be a full-time job. Turn it into a hobby and have some fun.